Hello everybody. In this video today we are going to talk about New South Wales state nomination requirements for subclass 491 which is the skilled work regional provisional visa which is granted for five years. Now to meet the requirements that are set by New South Wales for subclass 491 first you need to meet the requirements that are set by the Department of Home Affairs. So these requirements are that you are under 45 years of age, you have a competent English, you have a skills assessment, a positive skills assessment in your nominated occupation and you have a minimum point score of 65 points which includes the state points. So once you have met these requirements then you can uh, check to see if you also meet the requirements that are set by New South Wales for subclass 491. So what New South Wales has done is that recently they have updated their requirements and they have got three separate streams now depending on your situation and they have also got two separate occupation lists. So the first stream is for people who are already working and living in regional New South Wales. So to meet the requirements of this stream, your occupation needs to be on their relevant list, which is called the New South Wales Stream 1 Regional Occupation List. So if your occupation is on there, you have been living in New South Wales for 12 months in the regional uh, designated area, and you have been working in your nominated occupation for the 12 months in regional uh, designated area, then you are eligible for this stream and you can apply for subclass 491. So this stream is for people who are living outside of Australia and have their occupation on New South Wales Stream 2 occupation list. So apart from this, you also have to meet one of the three conditions that they have imposed for this stream. So one of those conditions is that you do have a job of a letter in regional designated area of New South Wales for a minimum of 12 months or you have a five years work experience in your nominated occupation, then also you can apply under this stream. And the third uh, criteria is that you have an immediate family member living in regional New South Wales in the designated area, and then also you can apply for this stream. So we will put the definition of the immediate family member in the description. So if you meet one of these conditions, then you can apply under this stream. The third stream is for people who have recently completed their studies in regional New South Wales. So you, you will need to check if your occupation is on the New South Wales Stream 2 occupation list and that you have completed your studies in the last one year and you have completed at least two years of studies in the New South Wales regional area and your occupation is relating to, is relating to your uh, qualification, then you meet the eligibility requirements for this stream. If you think you fall under any of these streams or your occupation is one of, in one of those lists that we have put the link for, please get in touch with us and we'll be happy to help you with your application. Thank you for watching Cyrus Migration. We make new videos every week relating to Australian migration. If you are interested in this topic, you may want to subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking on the subscribe button down below. You may also want to click on the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload new videos.